Hello friends, in this video we're going to learn another method of finding derivative that is power rule as it is written here. We need to find out the derivative of this function f of this function 5 times x to the power 9 by using power rule. I think already I have introduced you with the power rule, what is power rule and how to find out the derivative quickly with the using uh, with, with the use of power rule, right? So let me make you once more time review, let me review the power rule here. Like uh, you have the function y equals to uh, suppose uh, u to the power n suppose u to the power n means the the variable here here u is my variable and this variable is raised to the power n so in this condition we use the power rule and let me tell you power rule is really one of the quickest method of finding derivative really it will it will make your uh, i mean the the solution really short in a very short time quickly you will calculate the derivative of any function by using the power rule and generally we use this when a certain variable like here x is raised to the power n and here I'm giving the formula that here variable u you have and it is raised to the power n and that time what will be your derivative so derivative here your derivative is going to be dy by dx that is going to be here the power here n is the power so power times the variable to the power power minus 1 right here n is your power so power times variable to the power power minus 1 times derivative of variable with respect to x if you are going to differentiate with respect to x that time right here I'm differentiating my u to the power n with respect to x that's why this is my formula so here this 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 formula is now known as power rule, right so by using this power rule we can easily very quickly find out the derivative let me give you an example here as it is uh, as it is written here you 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 you're watching here right here my function is y equals to 5 times x to the power n x to the power 9 here my function is y equals to 5 times x to the power 9 right so here first I need to separate what is my variable and by how much power it has been raised here 5 is the constant so I don't have any problem because the uh, if uh, any co any constant is making a coefficient then coefficient we generally separate out that is an uh, effect right so first we need to deal what is our variable and what is my power here x is my variable and 9 is my power right so I have only uh, I have to only get concentrated on these two things so derivative of the function y with respect to x is going to be equal with first I'll write the coefficient right and then I'm going to deal with this guy x to the power 9 so here what is the power as it is here first the power times right so power is here 9 times variable to the power minus 1 here variable to the power minus 1 variable is raised to the power minus 1 so here my variable is x so I should have to raise x with the power minus 1 right and then times the derivative of the uh, variable with respect to itself and we know that a derivative of anything with re with respect to itself is always one if the if the variable have the power one or you, you want to say like dp derivative of p with respect to p is always one so you don't have to confuse this is always and always one whatever you are doing you, if you want to find out derivative of t with respect to t then that time also it will be one so that's not the matter that's not going to uh, uh, make any trouble to us now see 5 times n that is 45 times x to the power 9 minus 1 that is 8 and this is 1 so simply my derivative is going to be now dy by dx is going to be equal with 45 x to the power 8 that's my answer let me do here one more problem that will give uh, that will give you more idea about this uh, very near to that I want to do well suppose I have a function y equals to x to the power 15 right so in this case again derivative of y with respect to x I'm differentiating with right with respect to x so you don't have to confuse that's pretty simple power right as it is written here power that is my 15 times the variable to the power uh, variable should be raised to the power minus 1 so I'm writing my variable x and 15 minus 1 times again dx over the dx and that's going to be equal with now see as it is here 15 times x to the power 14 and this is 1 times 1 so finally my derivative is going to be equal with 15 x to the power 14 answer like this you need to find out uh, let me do one more here suppose I have a function y equals to 39 t to the power 7 then what I will do I will simply write derivative of y 
with respect to x i need to do now suppose suppose i'm differentiating with respect to x then it will be now first i'll write the coefficient then times power right according to the power rule power times variable should be raised to the power minus one so variable this t i'm raising with the power minus one again derivative of the variable with respect to what you're going to uh, you're going to differentiate so this so here my derivative is going to be now here 39 times 7 so let me multiply here 2 7 3 t to the power 6 dt over the dx this is my derivative and now see i'm writing here dt over the dx because this t and dx we cannot uh, get in the form here means we cannot get like dt over the dx we can't get one right that time i was differentiating x with respect to x that's why i was writing here one and here is don't there is no relationship between uh, between this t and then x so i have to write as it is right if i was differentiating this if i i, w I, w I have been differentiating with respect to t then it will be something different see here if y equals to here again the same 39 t to the power 7 and now i'm differentiating with respect to not with respect to x but with respect to t so here dy over the dt will be my 39 again same power right uh, let me change the color here right power this is power times power should be raised to the power minus 1 right 7 minus 1 and again derivative of the variable with respect to what you're going to differentiate i'm differentiating with respect to t so that time in this place now now here in this place i can write here one all right so and this is now see again 39 times 7 so that will be my 273 right so 273 times t to the power 6 so now my derivative is going to be here 273 t to the power 6 that's my derivative here so depending depends uh, by which you're going to differentiate right how you're going to differentiate with respect to with respect to what you're going to differentiate it matters right 